50% visible from all angles. They must be placed in a place with at least two exits. At least two exits. This room is a valid place. If you were to go down a dead end, you can't place a flag, a flag at the end of a dead end. When you place a flag, a judge must come with you to make sure it's legal. It'll be good times. If I'm carrying a flag and some stuff, not only is it continuously dispelled while I'm holding the flag, but even if I drop the flag, this is still dispelled for an additional minute afterwards. So I can't use it. And, you know, if people see me having it, then they can take it from me. It's so good. Um, yes. If there can be no flags within 10 feet of glyphs, like this. If a flag is within 10 feet of a glyph, which this is, then the glyph is dispelled. And it keeps being dispelled until the minute after the flag goes away. Because this can sometimes be a handy way to sleep in the rooms. Shh. <laughs> Alright, capture. Somebody red, get over here. Somebody else, hold this. So, say we're in yellow territory. I take. Gotcha. I don't have to say gotcha, but it's good because that way people know. That means I have captured you. That means I take you all the way back to my jail. You have to drop any flags you're carrying. If you were carrying, for example, a wand, I could say, give me your wand. <laughs> this, there you have it. And here's, the, here's where the concealed stuff comes in. If she's carrying something concealed, and I can't see it, and I don't know she has it, I can say, give me all your potions. I have no potions. Drat! She has outsmarted me! <laughs> However, if she, has a, if she has it out and in her hand, for example, eventually, then I can say, look, you have a potion in your hand, give it to me! And she goes, right. <laughs> On the other hand, if I have seen her use it, or seen her have it, since the last time she went to jail, I know she has it, so I can ask her for it. So if she used, for example, this to get out of jail last time, she bumped herself on the head and then went back, and then she came back, and I captured her again, and I say, I know you have a potion of jolt, give it to me. I was right! <laughs> if she didn't have it, she doesn't have to give it to me. <laughs> and, and it does count as concealment even if the outline is completely visible for comment. Yes. However, if it is so poorly concealed that it is half sticking out of your pocket, that doesn't count. I have a cell phone. What's going on? This is my wallet. So, if I am carrying her, taking her back to jail, and somebody stuns me, somebody on her team probably, but not necessarily. Oh no! I have to sit down for a minute. She goes free. The same is true when you get stunned by one of these. It's important to remember. I'll come back to that later. Alternatively. Alternatively. <laughs> I'll come back to that. Important thing to note about capturing. If there's a lot of people coming at me. A lot of people. And the first one says... Back, back up, guys. <laughs> And the first one comes at me and says, and tags me and says, Look, you have captured me. Now you have to take me to jail while all these other guys filter out behind me. I say, No, I have captured this person instead. I don't have to capture you if I don't feel like it. This is important to remember. What? <laughs> you don't have to capture somebody if you don't feel like it. You can, like, poke them and say, I didn't capture you. But try to avoid that if it's in a situation where it would cause confusion. How does this stop the neighbor's mom? What? Very carefully. <laughs> Alright. Jail! The clip of jail. It looks like that. When you come back to jail, you're supposed to touch the glyph. Not me, because this is my jail. But if I were captured and I were red, I would have to touch the jail upon being captured. Possibly by way of a human chain. You will see these. They will form. It would be great. Like this. So, every 15 minutes, when the clock says 30, 45, or 1, or 115, but that's the end of the game. Or 0, but that's the beginning of the game. Then, 
We everybody attached to the jail, everybody currently in jail, gets to leave and gets all the way to gets to go free back, all the way back to their territory by the quickest route as possible. Then you do this to indicate that you were in fact getting free backs and nobody can do anything to you. So there, you can make funny faces at them if you want to. If somebody is attached to the jail, somebody read it over here. If Glisten is attached to the jail and a free person comes along and tags Glisten, they both get free backs. It's good times. The jailer is the person wearing the fedora. What does this mean? It means they're ethereal. When you are ethereal, then magic stuff stops working for you and against you. It doesn't mean anything anymore. You can't drop it. You can't pick it up. It doesn't do anything. Same goes for flags. You can't be all walking back to enemy territory and be like, ooh, a flag and grab it. Doesn't work. You have to come back for it when you're not ethereal. Hey, Jared, am I allowed to make use ethereal hands when I'm not ethereal at other times? No! Remember rule zero? What's rule zero? Don't be a jackass! Right! So don't use re re reserved words or reserved hand signs. It's a bad time. You use reserved Fedora signs? No! The jailer Fedora! It's not necessary for a functioning jail. The jailer, the, the jail can just sort of exist, and the hat can just sort of be there or not. Either way, it doesn't matter. The jailer is the person wearing the fedora. They can say, "You guys don't have to form human chains. You can just sort of hang out, grab some water. It's a good time." They also get truth serum if they poke someone with their pinky finger. No. They get truth serum. They can ask six yes or no questions. The victim can lie for one of them. Is, is there a flag on the first floor? Yes. Is there a flag on the first floor? No. Is there a flag on the first floor? Yes. This does in fact mean that you may have to ask a question three times in order to get a truthful answer. At the end of six questions, he is free. He gets free backs to his territory. It is possible for, to ask five questions and then just stop. If the, if the jailer says you can go, then you can go. If the jailer doesn't, then you have to stick around until jailbreak happens, or the jailer goes out of sight, line of sight. Note. Or the jailer starts asking. Or the jailer starts asking somebody else questions. Yes. If the jailer frees you. Do you have free backs? Yes. If the jailer asks you questions and then just and then ends the questioning, you get free backs, regardless of how it ends. What if you don't know the answer to the question? You can say yes, no, or I don't know. I don't know questions don't count.